This is Mary at minialbumscraps.ning.com and I'm going to share with you today the stuffed altered paper bags and I believe the tutorial we followed for this was by Tamika at Scrap Da World S-C-R-A-P-D-A-W-O-R-L-D on YouTube and the first one up is by Lisa Levitt and Lisa made this one for me Gorgeous, gorgeous. Look at this trim. It's pretty. I believe one of the requirements was it was to have a wand of some type. So here's hers. Precious. So fun to see you do this kind of work. Usually I see the steampunk or the goth type from you, Lisa. This is so pretty. There were certain requirements to go in the bag. Um, I don't remember exactly what they were, but and I don't want to show everything because it's kind of a surprise for when everybody gets them, so I'm just going to show you this. So this one's by Lisa Levitt. Thank you, Lisa. Okay. Next up is Inez Moncado. There's Inez's. Here's Inez's information. Here's her tag. Oops, goes this way. I'm trying to look in the camera and not what I'm. And Inez made this one for me. Thank you, Inez. It's beautiful. Oh, she got brave and did a pinwheel. I started a vase. Julia sent me two little pinwheel, or not pinwheels, two little rosettes. So you know everybody has theirs in a vase. I got found a vase yesterday, so I'm starting to fill it up. This is very pretty, Inez. All kinds of goodies. Thank you, Inez. And this one's by Kimberly R. And Kimberly made this one for me. She made one for Julia. And I've already put Julia's in her box. I was sorting through everything. Isn't that cute? She's got real lollipops. Ah, and look, lavender. Oh my gosh. How fun. And is it you do the most awesome work. I just, the swap she did before was the, uh, the dead matchboxes, and I'll always remember them because they were so wonderful. Look at this cute rosette. Gold straw. And she's made all kinds of, here's her tag. I'll just show you that. It looks like she like she went all out. She made made up more things. Thank you, Kimberly, and thank you so much for making this for me and one for Julia. I love these colors. It's gorgeous. So pretty. This one's by Christine Harris. Christine also made this one for me. Oh, look at her little pinwheel. This is the way that I saw somebody do them, was they did them like this, because I wanted to get some little push pins. I see you used a thumbtack and that worked fine. You put them in the eraser of your pencil. Very cute. 
And here is Christine's, she's craftingwithchris.org. And she's just Chris Harris, I think, on YouTube. Here's her tag. Oh, she covered it. Look at that. There's no edges showing. Very cute, Christine. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Right, and then, next up is Sharon Jones. I'm gonna let you look at this for a minute. While I check, catch up. So this one's by Sharon Jones. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Oh, this rosette's, oh, look at this rosette. It's beautiful, beautiful. Here's another one. Oh, I love that. Where did you get this embossing folder? If you see it, it's all embossed. It's a ticket. I've never seen that. I'd love to know where you got it, where you got the embossing folder. I, I'm assuming that's an embossing folder. I think a lot of us would like to have that. like three one pocket two pockets I think three pockets look at the backs this is decorated at the front a little file folder oh, that's too cute great job thank you so much Sharon for joining in on this Give everybody one more peek. So this is by Sharon Jones. Okay, next up is Pam Lemming. Hey, Pam, I find you finally joined the swap and I remembered about those flowers. Long time ago, remember Marla sent flowers and we were divvying them up, whoever asked for them. I still had the bag for you. I have, and so I'm putting it in your box this time. Oh, here's her little paper bag. It's all springy. Love it. Look at her tap. She used embossing paste. Oh, that's pretty. Pretty, pretty. That's by Pam Lemming. Anyway, you'll get your, finally get your little flowers. Here's mine. And let's get rid of it. Here's one of, I'm gonna have all the tissue on it. I had fun making these. So this is mine. I have some trim down here. Flowers. My rosette. Oh, and I used a, one of the Heartfelt Creations dies to make that across the back. Here's my tag. So, those are mine. Bag. And 
Julia made me this one, so I'm gonna share it. There's her rosette. Doesn't she make the most gorgeous ones? So creative. Look at all the layers. And you know, we Skype all the time and craft together and we were using the skewers. They work pretty good for, for fitting right up in here. And she did hers with, what's that Graphic 45 Home, Home Sweet Home. Wouldn't you think that would be the hardest collection ever? And she just made it into something so neat. So a little bag. Here's her tag. Look at the little buttons. Bow. So pretty. Look at. Thank you, Julia. Amaryllis. This is Amaryllis's. And here's her tag. Throw kindness around like confetti. Very pretty. So that's my Amaryllis Casanova. Thanks for playing Amaryllis. And last, but not least, we have X's. Okay. It's ready. I just know hers is gonna be fantastic. What did I tell ya? Wow, is that all you can say is wow? Look at this. Did you just use packaging to do that? Little shaker, so neat. Great idea. Clothes pin, all kinds of goodies, all kinds of goodies. Look at her, let's look at her wand. There's this one. And then this one, shaker. I want to show what is her tag. So pretty. It is. So that's by X Montano. And that's it for the altered paper bags. Thanks for watching.